welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, welcome to my channel. And today I'm doing a Friday get ready with me. I'm just going to go to dinner with my son and my girlfriend. So I'm going to prime my face. I've already primed my face with the Neutrogena cream. Now I'm going to do a concealer to conceal my blemishes. Yeah, it takes a lot of balls to get on here with this, but it is what it is because I'm also, if you're just tuning in, doing a, um, doing my, uh, Indian clay mask too. So I have seen progress. Uh, so I've been documenting it. I've posted one for you guys. Um, I've got another one that I need to edit and post. Um, I'm going to get that stuff out to you guys because I took a few days off of work because I've been sick so tonight I'm editing for sure and I'm I've got a big mirror behind me so that's kind of what I'm looking at and this is just a simple um, Broadway it's by Broadway colors could contour artist cream this is a little messed up but it looks like that I don't know if you can see, but it's got the green right here for red pigmentation. This light purple, comment down below if you know what that is in a concealer. And then it's got the contour and the conceal, but I kind of use it all if you get what I'm saying. But I'm just simply contouring. I don't know if I'm going to beat beat my face. That was my intentions, but um. I'm, my son is starving. I'm starving, so I don't want to take too long. Plus, I don't want to have a super long video for you guys. But on a side note, I'm feeling a little better. I can breathe now. <laughs> um, my medicine has been... Ooh, I can breathe. I haven't been able to breathe in forever. So, because I'm always nasally have sinus problems always have uh, so that you know is is something good but anyways yeah I primed and concealed now I'm gonna get my foundation I know guys I know you're like God I always tune into her stuff she never has all of her shit together and I'm trying to get my life together so I can get things out to you guys in a more timely manner. The only way I'm going to succeed is if I go harder So and be consistent. Consistency is something that I really, really struggle with really bad. <laughs> and it, it really, it's inconsistency has caused a lot of things to go wrong or opportunities to be lost for me in my life so uh, I guess you could say not even just a New Year's resolution but a life um, resolution in general is to be more consistent if you will I don't put my hair back some way, shape, or form. I, just, I, I get so bummed because I start out so gun ho. I knew I didn't have everything together, but if when I I'll give you guys a, a furnished house tour, and I, when I get done, but I have like makeup drawers all through here, and it's just right here at reach. So. I can like grab anything that I don't have because I never know really what look I'm gonna do for you guys I just kind of go with it but I'm really thinking about getting licensed I want to be an esthetician so bad so but my thing is going to school you know and then a job because right now I'm doing a night shift job which works good it's really caused a lot of wear and tear on my body but it, it overall you know it's good with my schedule and my kids are getting older 
and I have the support, you know, from my spouse and and their father. So, you know, it's going good, but it's just hard. But I I would like to find some kind of online school that I could do that kind of goes with that my work and stuff but yeah school don't pay the bills so that's what in the, the oh guys school doesn't pay the bills is what I'm trying to say so I'm trying to find um, some kind of esthetician class that I can just do you know either online or um, does it consume so much hours I guess I should say that it jeopardizes, um, you know, my daily, my day-to-day -day life and schedule and work and mom and life and all of the above. So, yeah. But I'm applying the foundation, the one I always use, the LA Girl Truly Matte, great coverage, especially for my blemishes. Um, I've used all kinds of expensive foundations mac i was hooked on that for a while but just the concealer one because it with me i have to have yeah everything covers at the moment but it doesn't always cover for you know whatever i'm doing throughout the day so um I don't know what insecurities, if you have any at all, or what skin problems or things you battle with, but mine, like I speak on, is my blemishes, and I was so scared to get on here and do it, but, you know, I'm doing some skin regimens and healing things to get my face back into shape, and you guys, if you know it or not, are on the journey with me and right now we are doing the Indian my daughter the Indian healing the Aztec Indian healing clay mask my daughter's doing it as well so when I can catch her she's 15 and she's always on the go so when I can catch her I will do a update on her face as well all right so this la girl truly matt is really good comment down below if you guys have any um recommendations some may come for me in the comments because and talk about my blemishes but i'm aware they showed really bad in the last video the aztec one so the indian healing clay mask but it is what it is okay so I've applied that and as you know it looks like I need to get some more because I'm dipping it in with my brush but that's what I'm trying to say if you guys have any recommendations please let me know because I'm gonna go out and may probably buy some do not because tomorrow uh, I'm gonna do a Saturday night look for you guys all right so I've contoured I've foundationed so next I'm gonna just apply a little um, to my under eye this lighting is a little crazy so it may look a little off it may not but I'm gonna just apply because I've been sick and then also like I said I work night shifts so I sleep through the day and I'm still adapting a month later so you know it may a little baggy under all right so I've applied the lightest one in the palette it's right here oh the lighting sucks I'm gonna work on that too but the littlest one the lightest one not the littlest right there I don't know if you can see it but I'm trying to work on my time in this thing but now after that I'm applying a uh, Bobbi Brown true complexion loose setting powder and this is Bobbi Brown I have cheap foundations I have I mean guys I'm so scatterbrained I'm telling you I'm the silliest ditziest 
human being alone. But I have um, some drugstore makeup. I have dollar store makeup. And I have Ulta. Uh, not just Ulta, but some real expensive ones. And I just kind of use all what works best for me. So I kind of just put that in my under eye and let it set. I don't put it all around my face yet. Maybe in my T-zone I will because anywhere where I uh, battle with uh, the, the, you know, mix match complexion or where my makeup, I guess you would say, wears off the most. But I don't really set it or put any like uh, bronzer or just a facial powder on period because I like to apply a little bit of blush. Uh, a little shimmer, contour, all of the above. So, I'm trying to stay on track. Uh, anyways, I've got that. So, so far, I've contoured. I, I'm sure I have put some, not contour, oh my god, my day. Concealer, a foundation, and prior to that, I primed. So, next, I usually do my eyebrows. So, I kind of brushed them already, but... I will do that again. And then I also use this mirror as well to kind of go over it as I go. So, next I'm just going to, oh, my camera. Grab a tiny brush. This is one of, this is my everyday go-to brushes right here. Isn't that cute? Mm -hmm. Tiny brush. And my bag brought me a basket for my stuff. But I'll grab a tiny brush and usually something to go over my eye. I'm so working on, my last video was, what was that glitch? My last video was so long, my makeup, my last makeup video anyways. Um, and then I feel like my, uh, my Aztec one wasn't too long. I mean, it wasn't too short, but it wasn't long enough. So I'm trying to find that in between so I don't bore you guys, you know. But I mean, makeup take is a process. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to do my eyebrows. And then I'm going to prime my eyelids and get my shadow color together. And I might go ahead and blush and contour I'm not sure but I, right now I'm gonna do my brows prime my eyelids and I'll be back this is so frustrating anyways for the 30th time I'm back I did my brows and I primed my eyes it's a different background because I had to come downstairs because my family's home and I, I was determined to finish this video to get it out and usually I just get frustrated I don't finish it but I'm gonna finish it but anyway so I did my brows like I said and um I prime my eyes so and I did my brows out of the selfie kit palette pro fusion which I love you can literally do your whole face in that and I used this uh, the brown and the black with a eye brow gel that I use um, and I'm gonna do my shadow out of the Pro Fusion Shimmer, 10 Shade Shimmer Eyeshadow Palette. But, yeah, I'm just going to put just a little bit of blush where I've been kind of sick. Just a little. I can't find my MAC brush or I left it upstairs in my room where I usually do my vlogs for you guys. But, it didn't work out that way to know. Alright, and then I'm going to use a little bit of Dynamite. My palette's so dirty. It's crazy. I'm going to use a little bit of dynamite to add a little bit of bronze with it. So, going in, I did a little bit of the Nimbus, and now I'm going in with dynamite. And I usually use my MAC brush for that and the lighting's so shitty guys I'm sorry because I changed but you'll see I'll probably end up back up soon but so that but I don't feel like going back up and dip, getting my MAC blush brush but I'll finish it off with that but anyways I added a little powder with that so now I'm going to contour 
pour out of this smoky nudes thing. You don't only have to use like contours and blushes and shit like that for your eyes. You can use anything to do it as long as you know how to do makeup. So I'm going in with that to contour. And if you hear the fan going, sorry, but it gives it extra light. So I'm going to go in with Dusk to add a little contour to my cheekbones. My eyeshadow palettes are so dirty. I, where I told you guys previously, I need to put I need to put my shit up and put it in my drawers and stuff. But I keep looking in the mirror and getting out of focus and camera with you guys. So, anyways, I'm going in with Dusk right there. And don't come for me. I'm gonna go through my makeup and put it up neatly. Dusk. And I'm not going on an, I'm not doing anything extravagant. I just wanted to, I was putting a little makeup on, so I just wanted to get something out for you guys. And again, I'm sorry if the lighting is different. So, but yeah, I'm going in with a little dusk. Maybe a little flirt right here flirts here. It's dirty around my palette so it's so hard to see the name. Life's been hectic lately guys. So anyways I'm gonna clean the brush off after that and then I'm gonna go back I'm gonna go in with cocoa and I'm gonna add cocoa to like my nose and stuff. I'll be ready in a second. Sorry, this is why I can't get content out. YouTube is a passion for me, but if you don't have, if you're not pushing content out, you can't get it out. I mean, you can't, you can't progress in it. But anyways, there you go. I'm just going with a little basic shimmer tonight because for one, I'm being rushed and for two, I'm not really feeling it so so that's that next I'm just gonna do a little bit of eyeshadow guys for you I'm sorry that the shit has changed the vibe has changed but that's one thing I don't like to be rushed with is my makeup and then that sound is hellacious right there and if I oh I can turn it off sorry Okay, so I'm just going to go in with my Wet n Wild palette to do a basic color and I'm going to go in with, I'm going to go in with this. It doesn't really tell a name, but it's this one right there. And I'm just going to do that in my crease and I've wiped my brush off so it's going to stick because it's wet. I used to not wipe my brushes off at all before I started a new look and I would always get probably not the right color but that's why. That is why. That is exactly why. So I put that on my crease and I'll take my two-sided brush. I can find it. This one. This one is a I think it's a MAC brush, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Sorry about the background noise. Okay, that's done. Just a little pop. I use that color, red. 
So that, and now I'm just going to go on my eyelid, back to this palette, the Profusion, and get ready to relocate back upstairs because it's just like the entourage is followed. Okay, I'm going in with Dynamite again. Dynamite on this side. Okay, Dynamite. And then my under eye. Dynamite. Sorry guys, it's like I cannot get anything out. Like this is, I would get out so much more videos, but I can't because, I mean, I'm a mother and I am a, a, a wife or a spouse or whatever. Um, and it's like I don't have my designated room, beauty room yet, yet, to push content out for you guys. Uh, it's like. My girlfriend really doesn't understand, you know, the whole tutorial and, and beauty world. So, to some that don't get it, might think that it's just a bunch of bullshit, you, you know, or excuse my language, but it's really not. If you have a passion for makeup and stuff, it's more to you than that. So, you know, and I can't do it with a bunch of background noise. Like right now, you probably hear the freaking television. But at this point, I can't do anything about it. So I'm going in with this LA Color 16 color palette. I've had this one before. I lost it, but it's a really dope palette. So I'm just going right here with that. Sorry if you hear the game, the football game or the wrestling or whatever it is in the background. And then I'm going back on this side with it. This tutorial did not turn out like I wanted it. I cannot be rushed with my makeup because my makeup is everything to me. So I added that hint on the top which is really pretty. So and then I'm going to probably go hit a shimmer on my lid right there. But see right here my crease and that light. I'm going to add a darker color. So I'm going to go in with um, this dark deep cocoa color right there. This some of these palettes don't have names, so I just kinda hit that right there and kinda hit the crease. Right there. There and hit the crease. Get a little dark to it. My son was supposed to go tell my girlfriend I was doing a tutorial so I could just keep going with it and she would know because like I said she doesn't understand the whole YouTube world or tutorial world but he did it of course so I had to pause it and do all this and explain and so that's why I ended up in a whole different background and uh, to you guys it might have felt like a second but it really wasn't because I had to relocate downstairs. Lucky me. Alright, so I went in with like an aqua color over that and because that crease went a little dark. So boom boom. That looks pretty good. And then I want to take go back to the Pro Fusion and take a skinnier brush and I'm going to just hit like this probably this illusion actually I'm going to do this celebrate where am I 
Actually, I'm going to do Des Destiny. Ooh, I'm not even camera. I'm going to hit Destiny right there. Shout out to my baby girl. And I'm going to hit that right there. Or right there. Just like so. Destiny again. There, I always like that pop of color in my um, creases. Okay, what's up guys? My camera freaking died. So, um, I went ahead and finished my eyeshadow and then I put a my crease and then I did my liner and now with you all because I love you all I'm going to apply my mascara and all I'm I usually use two or three different mascaras and all I'm using is my elf and I may use my believe gold because it calms my lashes super good so but again my camera died I'm sorry I was determined to finish this and get this out to you guys so again after I put that pop of shimmer right here in my corners of my eyes I just did my liner you guys know how I do my liner and now today I'm applying my elf mascara so let's get it oh and I put my nose ring in so close to the camera I like this elf kind I lost it in my makeup stuff for the longest. So I couldn't find it. So that. And I'll do one more dip. That. I'm sorry this tutorial was everywhere but I'm doing I usually quit and give up if I get interrupted or I have to hurry I just stop it with you guys and then finish on but I was determined but like I said my camera died after I did all that but I got all the way to the corner of my um, crease but I told you guys what color I used I think it was like in in infinite or something crazy in that profusion palette so I said let me just go and get my clothes on and then I'll apply my mascara with you guys but like I said I did do my liner and I just did that with my elf liquid liner but I take a a MAC brush and a dip it instead of the skinny one because I like a thicker line and depending on the occasion I'll go more dramatic so but now I'm taking the believe and combing through my lashes I was gonna be extra and put um, put my lashes on because I bought a few packs like two weeks ago and I have not applied them yet because I feel like I only apply them when it's like date night or drinks or something as such. Oh my god. That to my freaking under eye. But I like using this one because it's a finer comb and it combs through my lashes better. And of course, it gets the under eye and also depending the occasion I will use um I have a mascara primer that I'll use too I'm not digging in my nose guys it's just my ring but so but anyways yeah so I was loyal finished it out and closing out the video can you guys believe it dedication so I used these two elf I used elf liner with a MAC eyeliner brush in the elf liner to make my liner thick my line thicker and then i use my elf mascara which is bomb i love elf it's backward to you guys and then my believe beauty which is dollar store brand but it's their their 
go I mean I guess it's their brand but it's their brand but not their brand it's like a five dollar beauty line they have I've seen a lot of um, reviews on it from Jeffree Star and a few other people but um, it's actually bomb palette I don't care for their foundation because or I have to mix their foundation because like my, my blemish issue but again you know um, it just doesn't apply the coverage that I need that matte coverage but again it's a good it's good all right so that that and now I'm just gonna go in elf elf I don't know I grabbed all my elf but now I'm gonna go in with the elf lip to top it off and it is called it's elf eight two four six eight wine focus camera I don't know if you see it, but it's e.l.f. as well, so e.l.f. liner, after the camera cut off, e.l.f. liner with a MAC brush to make it thicker, liquid liner, because I don't like it in there, e.l.f. mascara, and an e.l.f. lip, top it off, and we're done. And we're done. I'm just going to top it off with a gloss. But, anyways, we're done, guys. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. And thanks for tuning in to my video. Love you guys. And.